Welcome to Aurora Chemistry for everyone. When aldol condensation reaction taking place between two different aldehydes or two different ketones, then it is called cross aldol condensation. For aldol condensation reaction to carry out, the reaction must satisfy certain conditions. There must be the presence of carbonyl group. There must be the presence of alpha hydrogen. The reaction should carry out in the presence of dilute alkyl. We are here to discuss that cross aldol condensation reactions between benzaldehyde and acetophenone. That means one aldehyde and one ketone group. If you look at that benzaldehyde, it does not contain alpha hydrogen. But in acetophenone, there must be the there is the presence of alpha hydrogen. First, what is alpha hydrogen? The hydrogen which is present next to that carbonyl group is called alpha hydrogen. So here C double bond O is the carbonyl group that is the functional group. So the next carbon the hydrogen is attached here isn't it. So there are three alpha hydrogen. So the first step in cross aldol condensation reaction is the formation of nucleophile. This acetic that means alpha hydrogen reacts with the base and resulting in the formation of nucleophile. So first of let us draw that nucleophile that means removal of one acetic hydrogen C double bond O CH2 one acetic hydrogen is lost whenever that acetic hydrogen is leaving it loses that its electron on that carbon so because of that this carbon becomes electron rich and it behaves like a nucleophile. So this is the first step in cross aldol condensation reactions. Now if we look at the benzaldehyde, the CHO group is the function group here. This we can write it like C double bond O H. So here oxygen is highly electronegative, so partial negative and this carbon will get partial positive. That means this carbon can act like a electrophile. So nucleophile always attack that electrophile right so this carbon will attack that this electrophilic carbon attack that nucleophilic carbon of this one so because of that there is the formation of c c bond so this step is very important nucleophile attack that electrophile so c double bond o then hydrogen then this phenyl group we are going to draw in such a way for better understanding, let me draw the structure again by keeping this nucleophilic part here. So that first let me draw the phenyl group, then after that C double bond O, then CH2, then there is the formation of C hydrogen, then double bond O, then again you go to draw that one phenyl group. So this is step 1. Now this is step 2. In step 2, protonation will take place. So when protonation takes place in the presence of acid, this H plus ion will attach to this OH group and resulting in the formation of beta hydroxy ketone. So we go to draw again the same step, same structure, only that modification double bond O, now OH group we will get. The remaining other things we can write it in such a way so sorry here one hydrogen and then c double bond o one phenyl group if you look at this structure then OH group is also present and keto group is also present so this is alpha because it is next to that function group and this is beta so we can call this structure like beta hydroxy ketone so this is also called ketol because there is the presence of ketone group and there is the presence of OH group this group immediately undergoes dehydration that means removal of water so this is step 3 so in all our condensation we have the three steps step 1 is nucleophilic formation step 2 is protonation step 3 is dehydration whenever dehydration taking place this OH group and alpha hydrogen this is very important alpha hydrogen is ready to lose due to the removal of H2O we will get CH double bond then CH then after that C double bond O then one phenyl group here 
the same way left side also we have one feral group we can numbering first 1 2 3 so there are two feral group 1 3 diphenyl then in the second position we have double bond so 2 e then 1 moon 1 3 diphenyl 2 e 1 moon is the cross alcohol condensation product when benzaldehyde and acetophenone undergo cross alcohol condensation reaction this we can also call benzoyl acetophenone thanks for watching